Okay, so I have been looking for a good saw, all around cheap saw for the uh, for the household, because in if we do woodwork or any kind of a work uh, around the house, we need a good saw. I've been searching for the one that can do everything and cheaply, rather than uh, do the best for any kind of task. For example, if you want to cut tree branches. I have the chainsaw, but chainsaw doesn't do precise cutting, right? So for cutting wood, then we need maybe a table saw, and for curve cutting, we need a jigsaw, and for all around cutting, maybe a, a hand saw, but a hand saw needs a lot of muscles, it's a lot of work. So I've been looking for one saw that does, that does all these, and it doesn't cost a much, lot of money. So Black Decker makes this navigator saw it's a power hand saw or you could call it hacksaw and jigsaw combination so I think if you just have one saw at home then this would be it it costs you about forty fifty dollars and that's pretty much all the things I mentioned above okay so let's take a look at this navigator power hand saw so this is basically the saw as you can see, this is corded, so plug in any outlet uh, or I mean, extension cord, of course, because the, the cord is not very long, so you need the extension cord if you want to cut trees, like something like that. So operation is pretty simple. This is the, the saw blade, comes with a protector, kind of like a regular hand saw or hacksaw blade attached to the body. And so operation is very easy. You just this is the safety kind of a safety button. You have to press this first, and then this is the squeeze. Cause you see, you can't squeeze it right now because the, the safety button is not pressed. If you squeeze this, it should operate. The saw will work. You do this first, then you can squeeze down, and then you can release this and just use it just to saw. This is the second hand grip. If it's too hard to press down, you use you put your hand here to do the cutting. Okay, that's pretty much it for the the operation of the saw. And to to take the saw blade out or put it in, here is the release button. You press this in, you should be able to release. See, you you, you just press this down, twist it. Should should be able to take the saw blade off. There you go. And if you look at this, this is where this is where the the saw blade goes in, like this. You can see. I don't know if you can see. There's a, a black kind of a knob, and this this hole should fit on the knob there. And then just twist it back towards there. That, that fits in. Okay, a lot of people uh, online complain that it's very hard to put in. That's because if you see that this, this knob, or maybe from this side and here, you can see it has a slit. So it shows you on the manual, it's probably easier to see on the manual. Here. So this black knob thing, there's, there's, there's a slit. It has to face this way in order for your saw, saw blade to come in, come, uh, fit in. If it's facing this way, then you won't fit the saw blade in there. So you use a screwdriver basically to twist it if it's not in the right position. So a lot of people overlook this and they can't put the blade in at all. But once you know this, it's very simple. So that's the operation of the, the hand saw. And if you take that off, you can replace it with a jigsaw for curve cutting. This is a jigsaw blade, something like that. And I guess I should face this way. Uh, this way. Yep. 
should work the same way. Yep. So now this it fit in. Remove the protector. So this is how you you operate operating how, how you operate the jigsaw. So same concept. Press the safety button and just cut like this. Okay. So it actually shows you on <coughs> on the side how it works. So it's you can't miss it. And for uh, so basically it comes with these two blades, this navigator. Uh, if you want to cut metal, like metal pipe, there's also attachment for metal cutting, but you need to buy it separately. These are just for wood cutting. So overall I find, find this replaces all the other, other saws, although it doesn't do any particular job the best, but it is the best all around saw. Okay, just to show you um, how this part works. Uh, this basically, um, this part is normally in this position. So you put the, the handsaw blade here, you use it as a handsaw, right? So, but if you use a jigsaw, just twist this to this position, and you put the jigsaw blade here, so this is kind of flat. You can use this as a, a platform, sur flat surface. To cut as a, as a jigsaw. That's how this handle works. Yeah, and this just to add something to the video. This is the metal saw. If you can see the fine tooth, it's it's called kind of like those uh, um, metal cutting uh, the hand saw cutting pipes. And it's the same concept. Just put it in there and twist and twist towards the position, it's locked, it's for cutting pipes, okay, and thanks for watching.